Jellicle cats come out tonight. Jellicle cats come one, come all. The Jellicle moon is shining bright. Jellicles come to the Jellicle ball. To be honest with you, I have a niece. And she contacted me and said, listen, we're doing a local theater production uh, of cats. Now that was the problem, shorthanded on humans. They were all ill. Coincidentally, she had this genius idea to use real, live cats. The cats are not available. So we had to use actual dogs. Dogs to play cats. Now I know what you're thinking. That's crazy. I know. Buster Hoot Jones is not skin and bones. In fact, he's remarkably fat. He doesn't haunt pubs. He has eight or nine clubs. For oh, he's the St. James's Street Cat. Oh, A design is a design. It doesn't matter who wears it. As long as there are a few spangles and sparkles, You just need a hole for the tail, that's all. Only difference. Only difference is a hole for the tail. If you offer me pheasant, I'd rather have grouse. Mungo, Jerry, and Rump. Teaser were a notorious couple of cats as knockabout clowns, quick change comedians, tight rope walkers, and acrobats. I believe it is a deuteronomy. You know, I used to watch dog fashion shows as a child, I loved them. I, what's greater? What's greater than a pink poodle in a dress parading down a runway with a husband, a real husband poodle? I can't think of something that is better than that. Until now, with cats. Dogs dressed as cats performing cats. <laughs>